Oh, iDubs, man. Really? You had to go out your way to make this video. If you haven't seen this video already, for me, this is probably one of the worst iDubs videos I've ever watched. And you know why? Because it involves this hoe. And you might be thinking, Kavos, that's a bit harsh, calling her a hoe. Please just wait. Watch the video. So iDubs made a video addressing the OnlyFans drama. If you don't know, iDubs girlfriend made an OnlyFans account and the simp memes were glorious. Everyone was memeing on iDubs, calling him a simp because his girlfriend was selling her body to get paid. Let's jump into the iDubs video. For those of you who are unaware of the drama I recently brought upon myself, I'll fill you in. My girlfriend started an OnlyFans account which is a website where you can upload amateur porn. Anything from double penetration all the way over to lewd cosplay and everything in between. And uh, I think all of it is cool. Yeah, I know. Oh my God, what? If you ever told me that iDubs would say on camera, on video, that OnlyFans was cool, I would tell you to go fuck yourself because I would never believe it. Even when he's saying it, he doesn't look like he wants to. He looks like his girlfriend has a gun behind the camera threatening him. And uh, I think all of it is cool. Yeah, I know. It's cool. I mean, you can defend your girlfriend for having OnlyFans in many ways. Other than saying that it's cool and he thinks it's great and really cool. A good amount of people are just doing the reasonable thing and just making jokes and laughing about it. But there's a whole nother group of people who feel personally devastated and betrayed. First up, we got Edward. No, shut the fuck up, you dumb fuck. You don't get to ha ha funny yourself out of this one. You're a simp. You act all edgy and cool on YouTube and then go and film your girlfriend shoving anal beads up her ass for OnlyFans afterwards? Fuck you. You lied to everyone. You ruined my life. Oh. Looks like I did something a little too edgy. Firstly, how is iDubs taking this tweet seriously? I'm 99% sure that tweet is completely ironic. And it's just memeing on him. It doesn't seem like he actually feels like his life is ruined because iDubs is a simp. Edward, I don't know where you got the idea that I was cool. He's being very defensive. Then he starts kind of trashing his old content to try and defend... His girlfriend's only fans. Do you think it was cool when I was when I was playing with anal beads? It's cool when I play with anal beads. Do you think it was cool when I was running around in an oversized cop outfit? That was cool to you. The content you just brought up as an example was very funny. Everyone enjoyed it. I don't see the comparison between that and your girlfriend having an OnlyFans. It's because he's a hypocrite. He makes content cop and targets people, but he himself have girlfriend whoring herself. And he does nothing about it. What am I gonna do? Do you think I should just, like, take a shotgun to her head? No, bitch. It's time to die now. No, items, you should break up with her. But I'm cool with it. You do realize there are guys out there in private right now jacking off to your girlfriend. But I guess it's out of sight, out of mind, it's not a problem. Hey, Tubbs, what the fuck is that argument? There is no way in hell you can compare one guy, maybe, Jacking off over someone's girlfriend because he might fancy them in real life to your girlfriend Selling her body on OnlyFans so that men can actively wank over her. It's not out of sight out of mind One is actively Imploring you know begging guys to wank over them because that's how they make their money The other is just your girlfriend where one creepy guy might wank over her. I don't even know how regularly that happens. You're acting like that's a regular thing. Such a horrible argument. And how is it coming from iDubs? His shit used to be tight. And now he's just flopping all over the place. And honestly, it, ha it just has to be the pussy power. That pussy power, man. We've all seen it in real life. We know what it is. We've seen guys be consumed by it. I've seen my friends stop hanging out with me and my mates because he got a girlfriend. But now in iDubs case, the guy who made solid arguments is just making awful arguments and comparisons. I find it very fascinating that a commentary YouTuber who's known for criticizing others, much like me, would be willing to take the position that sex work is beneath them. Uh, that they aren't on the same level as sex work. That's fascinating. I find it really interesting that that is the... Uh, that's the position you want to take.
That, I think that'll age quite nicely. I don't have a problem with sex workers. I'm not like, oh, I hate them so much. I don't have a problem with them. But what I do find funny as fuck, and the main reason this makes me really laugh, is that, you know, Idol thinks OnlyFans is so cool. I think all of it is cool. So cool. He just loves how cool OnlyFans is. He would never, ever have made fun of that. That's out of the realm to ever think Idols would make fun of that. But... His girlfriend most definitely has. You know, the one who is now actively on OnlyFans. On Twitter, a few months before she actually took the plunge, she tweeted out, We are all just one bad stream day away from an OnlyFans career. Would be willing to take the position that sex work is beneath them. Just one bad stream away from an OnlyFans career, looking down on OnlyFans. Say that Twitch streamers are on this pedestal and if you fail, oh, you might have to go to OnlyFans. Not even your own girlfriend for OnlyFans was cool a couple of months ago. Is cool. And not just once. Who remembers Zoe Berger? Zoe Berger, the infamous YouTube streamer who used to flash and used to get loads of donations, who kind of revolutionized that industry of e-girls because she was so free and open about it. No one could ever call her out because that was her thing. She made a gaming team called Lux. It was a load of other e-girls also, you know, also posting nudes of themselves, basically an OnlyFans team. People had their opinions about it, and one person who definitely had an opinion on it was iDub's girlfriend. It seems she didn't like it at all. No, I, I never wanted, I never wanted to join Zoe's Ho Squad. Ho Squad? What? You can't call them that. What? Because Zoe Berger and her friends sold their nudes online. They are hoes. Well, welcome to the Ho Squad, baby, because you're deep in it now. Uh, Lacey is thick AF. You know why they be f and it's hot AF. Lacey would probably be a pretty good porn star, actually. Who's got a porn face? Well, <laughs> I said your girlfriend has kind of like the Kate Upton thing going on. The like, uh, Kate Upton, you know, was rejected by uh, Victoria's Secret because they said that she looked like uh, a football player's girlfriend or like a porn star or something. She's just got oh, that very, very, like, very like f face. I don't know how to put it. Like, it's just very like. I don't know. Like, she's very hot, Kate Upton, but she would make a good porn star. Lacey would make a good porn star. Thanks. Look who's the fucking porn star now, clearly trying to use it as an insult on Chris Raygun's girlfriend. Oh, how the turntables have. Now, when we go back to Ian's video, remember her looking down on people who did the exact same thing as she is doing right now. Now, let's go back to Ian's video. So on the cons, we have everyone can see what he sees for a few dollars. What exactly do you think I'm seeing? Do you think she's shooting fireworks out of her pussy? Do you think she's screening the Matrix Reloaded down there? It's not a mystery. It's a pussy, dude. And then there's no special pussy. It doesn't become less valuable the more people see it. If that's the case, my body and my person is the most valueless thing on the planet. Did he really just use that? He just used the most slam dunk simp argument I've ever heard. He said he doesn't mind people seeing his girlfriend naked or selling nudes because every pussy is the same. I'm sure it's not too old fashioned for me to say, but I wouldn't want other guys seeing my girlfriend naked. I feel like it's perfectly normal to think that, that if you have a girlfriend, you don't want other guys having access to her in any way. Let me ask you this. If your girlfriend sent nudes to another guy while you were in a relationship, what would you do? I don't know about you, but I would break up that bitch straight away. But the argument he's made about all pussies are the same, like, I don't mind others seeing it. He seems like he is in denial. Like it's your girlfriend. You would never actively choose or encourage her to have an OnlyFans, and this is what it's kind of seeming like you're saying in these videos. I think all of it is cool. It's not even that you're accepting it, it's like you want it to happen. I think people would respect you far more if you just came out and said, look, I clearly don't like this. I can't control what she does though, and I still love her, so I will still be with her. Instead of this OnlyFans advert you've pitched to everyone, how cool it is, how every vagina is the same, so you don't mind everyone seeing it. It's just a bunch of horseshit, okay? I'm sorry. What do you think? Someone's just gonna make an OnlyFans just on a whim? Didn't give it any thought, just thought maybe I'll sell my pussy online and see how it goes. This made me laugh because 
In my head, this is exactly how I imagine most OnlyFans starting. Didn't give it any thought, just thought maybe I'll sell my pussy online and see how it goes. Especially people who aren't super famous already and just make OnlyFans. I personally know of people in my real life who started an OnlyFans and I'm pretty sure this is the exact conversation they had with themselves. I still like iDubs. I never cared about the OnlyFans. It was a funny meme. I tweeted about it, but now... After watching this video, I, it's it's different. It makes it all so different. I really wish he just didn't make this video and kept making content normally. The thing is, iDubs has made fun of people for much less. Leafy for having no chin. Rice scum for flexing all the time. Yeah, now people are making fun of you for being a simp. A simp? It's all memes and jokes for the majority of it. Now you've made this video and are defending something that your own girlfriend, who is the one who made the OnlyFans, didn't even think was cool, looked down upon, and you're telling us that we shouldn't look down on these people, but your girlfriend has already done it. It's a hard message to swallow. You know what? Ultimately, she wins the most out of all of this. iDubs essentially has made a nine minute OnlyFans commercial. Everyone now knows on iDubs YouTube channel, who probably never knew, that she has an OnlyFans account, and I guarantee her OnlyFans account right now is skyrocketing. Then he ended the video with this absolute cherry on the cake. I love my girlfriend and I'm totally fine with dudes jacking off to pictures of her on the internet. I never thought I'd also say anything like this. And I, it doesn't offend me, but it just shocks me. It's just a really weird thing to say. I dubs, your own girlfriend doesn't even believe the message you're trying to spread in this video. So this video was pointless. It didn't even need to be made. If anything, let her defend herself. But yeah, that is it for this video. Let me know what you think down below. Please subscribe if you're new. Leave a like if iDub's girlfriend is part of the hashtag host squad. Can I get a hashtag host squad in the comment section below? Because she is. If that's what she wants to call people, she's a part of it too. My Instagram is kavos.yt. If you want to follow that, I don't have any nudes. I don't post any raunchy lewd pictures, but... I actually do talk to some fans in DMs and I've had a conversation with many, many viewers through Instagram. I would appreciate the follow very much. My Twitter at CavosYT as well. That's where everything goes down. Please go follow that because we're trying to get it to 100k. That would be insane. Thank you so much for watching and until next time, fuck off.